Hey guys, welcome to Outlaw Edge. Uh, a while back, my buddy got me this uh, Mora Eldris, and I've been out here using this thing today. And I think these are one of the awesome, most awesome little uh, neck knives that Mora has ever come out with. And I guess their only neck knife that they've ever come out with. But I, a lot of guys wear Moras on their neck just so they have it, you know, boom, right there. And that way, if, if your knife is gone, you can stop what you're doing and look around for your knife. But, uh, there's a lot of cool, little cool little things and uh, tricks with these uh, knives that you can do that uh, I don't know if everybody knows about, you know. Um, these, uh, they come with a 90 degree spine and it makes it nice because <clears throat> my stomach's growling. I got to get my soup done. It's over there boiling away right now. Um, they, they put a really sharp 90 degree spine on and it makes it nice because... They throw some amazing sparks off these uh, fire steels. And this is a Mora knife fire steel right here that I carry on my neck. I have this on me 24 hours a day, seven days a week, no matter what, no matter where I'm at, I always have my fire steel with me. But uh, these Mora knives, uh, it, it's awesome that they finally came out with a little neck knife to carry around. And it's a Scandi grind. And it has a, another Scandi grind down here below. And it's uh, so it's got a Scandi here and, a, and then a Scandi here. And one is a real wide Scandi. And then one is only about uh, a quarter inch scanty grind on the bottom. And they are extremely sharp. And there's no secondary bevel. Um, it has a 90 degree spine on here for striking the fire steel, which is super sharp. And these are nice, short little knives. But they have, for guys that have big hands, they have a nice big, you got a big purchase on here on this handle because it's a nice wide handle. And it's got a really grippy rubber grip on here that if you get blood or grease or oil or water on your hands it's not going to slip and slide around and uh these things are just scary sharp i mean <clears throat> you know if you're doing any whittling or setting traps or anything like that you know they just dig right into the wood They are just scary sharp, sharp knives, just like any other Mora. Um, so don't let their size fool you. But one of the cool things is you can take this Mora, and it's, it comes with a plastic sheath, and you can put the paracord on the bottom like this, and set it up so you have a lanyard to put around your neck. And they make these deals where you can uh, put on the back so that, if, so that you don't get choked, it'll just pop right off. I don't have them on here, I don't ever carry those, I don't care about that. Um, but uh, which some people say is dangerous, but that's their opinion. But one of the cool things that you can do with a Mora, after putting your lantern on here and using it as a neck knife, if you have bigger hands, <clears throat> you can take that knife and spin it around in its sheath like this. And then that way, <clears throat> that way you got a little bit more purchase on here. And you can use it to uh, cut like you're doing here. pretty cool little trick you, that works with these Moros and I've never seen the other ones do that so I'm not sure if maybe the bigger Moros do that or not but I thought it was pretty cool this is a neat little neck knife so <clears throat> but anyways hope I didn't bore you guys appreciate you watching um, I'm out here in the woods today just enjoying it it's nice it's snowing right now and it's uh it's about maybe 30 degrees or something it's not that cold but uh it's pretty nice but uh, I, I wanted to do some videos and I really appreciate all your support on my channel and uh, thank you for coming out here and enjoying join the woods with me Anyways, thanks for watching.